Hi, I'm Luann Aiken with Tagawa Gardens here in Centennial, Colorado, and I'm here today with Mike, a man who knows his trees, certified arborist with Tagawa's, and he wants to talk about something that really concerns him that could be life or death for your trees. Girdling roots, not exactly a household term. <laughs> no. Um, so yeah, it's, a, it's what's called a girdling root. It's a lot of times in your existing tree, the trees in your yard right now, it can be right at the soil level. And it's basically a root that's growing kind of around the tree, right into the trunk of the tree. And it's pretty, pretty visible, pretty, uh, pretty obvious that it's kind of almost strangling the tree. So we're going to look at one today and kind of talk about how to deal with that. Okay, so on this tree, a, a good way to start is to sort of grab a shovel and excavate around. These were, these roots here were really obvious. We knew we had a problem even before digging around, but we went ahead and dug around, exposed a little bit more. And yeah, so what I'm gonna do is start with this smaller root here. It's actually a part of this root that comes straight across. So I'm gonna start with uh, just using the loppers here and start with this smaller root and eliminate that. So we're gonna make the cuts and then completely remove them. And then for these larger, this larger root here, I'm gonna very carefully make some cuts with a chainsaw. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut under here. And make... At this point, we're getting into larger wood, so I'm gonna uh, crank up the chainsaw. And obviously that can throw dirt around. I uh, definitely recommend uh, ear protection and eye protection. And I'm gonna go ahead and get busy and see what we can get into. Yeah, this is, uh, this is pretty extreme. I mean, you do see it uh, on trees uh, along the front range. Um, you see them, it seems like more, more frequently in faster growing trees, such as the American elm like this one, or maples. Um, but there's a, there is a large root here that we're removing. We're not quite done yet, but um, in this situation, I'd probably recommend um, getting a certified arborist out there to take a look at it because once you start removing these larger roots, you can create a stability issue uh, with the tree. If you remove too much um, and destabilize the tree, it could blow over in wind or a snow load. This was a pretty extreme girdling root here, but a few cuts and it, it solved the problem. This really is impressive. Mike is impressive. Our Tagawa nursery staff is impressive. Bring your questions to us. We are your garden store and so much more. If you like this video, please share it with your friends and find others like it on our Tagawa Gardens YouTube channel. Also, find us on Facebook and Instagram.